Welcome to Draw Kids, where anybody can learn to draw. Today we're drawing an awesome scarecrow just in time for fall. So grab your pen, paper, and something to color with, and let's draw. Perfect. So here we are drawing our scarecrow. Now, our scarecrow is pretty much going to take up the whole page from here to here. But what we're going to do is we're going to start about three quarters of the way up the page, and we're going to start with his two eyeballs. So let's do two circles. One two, about that wide apart. Nice. Now inside of those, put another little tiny circle, one on each, and we'll color in the, the one side. Moving on, we're going to do his nose. Now his nose is going to be like a pear shape. It doesn't have to be perfect because this is a scarecrow. So kind of like a per pear shape, just like that. Awesome. What we're going to do next is we're going to do two cheeks one on each side. They could be circles as well and they don't have to also be perfect. So circle and circle. Good job. Now from there we're going to do a smiley face but what we're going to do is we're just going to do dotted lines. So just connect dot 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 like a smiley face. Perfect. Now over the top is going to be like an arc like the top of his hat. So we'll just do a nice little arc right over the top. Good. Now next we're going to do his face. So his face is just going to be a round circle. We're going to connect from one end to the other end straight to the hat. Again, this doesn't have to be perfect because he's a scarecrow. Just like that. Nice. So this arc right here is the bottom brim of his hat. We're going to do another line a little bit shorter just above that. So kind of following the same arc. Good. So from there we're going to just connect these two lines. That's going to be the brim of his hat. Alright, moving on, we're going to do the top of his hat. This is going to be like a just a hook, kind of like that. So up and over the top, again it doesn't have to be a perfect, he's a scarecrow. Good. Now we're going to do this side of his hat. We're going to start about here and do a line right down. Good. Now we're going to do the top part of his hat and we're just going to close that off. It can be curved, it can be pointed, it can be however you want it. Good job. Next we're going to do his neckline. So we're just going to do like a almost like an outline just on the bottom of his, of his face. His head is kind of like a potato sack so we're just going to, this is kind of like the rope tying it together. Good. Next we're going to draw two lines coming down. This is going to be the, the bottom half of the sack. Good. Now this line connecting them can be wavy. Awesome. What we're going to do next is we're going to do his arms. One straight out that way and one straight out that way. Maybe about that long. Good. Now the bottom of his arm, maybe about that wide. Same on the other side. Good. Now what we're going to do is we're going to close off that sleeve. On this side we're going to curve it this way. And on this side we're going to curve it the same way. So it looks like this, this is turned this way a little bit. Good. Next we're going to draw his body. His body is going to be like a pear shape and it's going to come out down together like here. So we'll start on his armpit here and curve it down. Same thing on that side, we'll come down and curve it down and we'll meet this line. Good. Now the same like we did here on his face, we're going to do a real thin line for his belt right here on his belly. So coming from here, let's just do a thin line. Good. And again, just like here, we're going to do two flare outs and then we're going to cover the do the bottom of his shirt like that. So like a flare out there, a flare out there, and just like here we're going to cover this with a curve. Good. Now we're going to do his legs. So starting here about a center we're going to do a little V. That's going to be where his legs come together. And from there we're going to go down about maybe an inch. That's the center of his legs. Good. 
Next we're going to do a curve on each side, just one curve. This is the bottom cuff of his leg. One there, and one on this side. Nice. So from his hip to the bottom cuff of his leg, we're just going to connect. One on each side. Perfect, we're almost there. So coming out of his hands and coming out of his feet is hay. So we're just going to do like some jiggity jaggedy lines for the hay. One that way and one that way. Perfect. Same thing down here. Some hay and some hay. Good. So one thing our scarecrow is missing is he's missing his pole. So for down here on the bottom, let's go ahead and just give him a little pole. That's what's holding him up. Good job. Now two more things. We're going to do a patch on his knee. We're going to just do a square. And around that square, we're going to just do a couple little stitches. Stitch, stitch, stitch. Nice. And we'll do another patch here on his stomach. Just a square and some stitches. Perfect. Oh, we missed one thing. We missed his hair. So right here underneath his hat, let's do some more hay just like this. So under his hat, you can do some hay just coming out. There. Perfect. There's your scarecrow. Let's color. Thanks for hanging out with us, drawing the scarecrow. If you enjoyed yourself, don't forget to subscribe so you can draw more with us on Draw Kids. Bye!